The Easter Bunny works one day a year, travels the world, and is beloved by everyone. Who wouldn't want a job like that? Hello, welcome to Premier Scene. I'm Claire Bueno, and we are here for the gala screening of Russell Brand and James Marsden's new film, Hop. to be crowned the Easter Bunny. Look, Dad, I want to drum in a band. I want to see the world. He be the Easter Bunny sees every country in one night. Oh, really, Dad? What about China? Oh, yeah. oh, 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 it's candy, woman! <laughs> right, so we haven't cracked China yet. Jason Isaacs, always a pleasure, never a chore. <laughs> Marvellous. How are you doing? Are you, that's not real rabbit, is it? No. <laughs> I didn't even think of that, actually. <laughs> Come prepared. <laughs> Yes. How are you doing? Uh, good, we're late. We're worried we're going to miss the rabbits. I heard there's rabbits to play with here. Have you seen them? Oh, they're upstairs, I think. Okay, good. Yeah. We're good then, we're here in time. What do, what do you think? It's on the way to get here, yeah? <laughs> what do you think about the sort of uh, animation and uh, motion picture as well, the combination? What, the, in this film? For you, generally, as an actor. Uh, when it's well done, it's always about the storytelling. If the story's great, then, then it serves it. If the story's terrible, it doesn't matter if it's a hologram. So uh, these are great storytellers, because we loved Alvin and the Chipmunks, so looking forward to seeing it. Russell, Gra uh, Gr Russell Grand. Russell Grand. <laughs> yeah, even, yeah, Russell Brand. God, he's back on television, on the screen, big screen where he belongs. No, Russell, Russell Brand. He's fantastic. He's an, he, uh, he's an extraordinary talent. I hope he was allowed to improvise. I like him when he's off the leash. He really has turned into an acting talent, hasn't he? So, excuse me, someone more important story. What do you want, darling? I really want to go and see the bunny. Yeah, I don't blame you. Let's say thank you very much to this lovely lady and her Thank rabbit. you, Jason. Have a good day. <laughs> I don't want to be the Easter bunny. 4,000 years of tradition doesn't end just because one selfish bunny doesn't feel like doing it. My dad's right. I do need to get my act together in Hollywood. What are you expecting from this film? Um, Russell Brand. <laughs> Terror. <laughs> How about that? Would you ever have thought that Russell Brand would have been the Easter Bunny? No, actually. When I used to watch him, was it a Little Brother's Big Brother and all that? You know, I used to think um, he reminded me of a Freddie Mercury, you know, that kind of like big rock star kind of thing. And like, he's doing so well in Hollywood, isn't he? So I'm, I'm really, really. He's doing phenomenal. I mean, he's doing great. Well, as you know, in the entertainment industry, you, you just can't say no to anything. Yeah, exactly. Uh, he sort of whatever he's done, he's done with credibility, hasn't he? Really? Yeah, yeah. Which is, the, I mean, the thing about it as well that he plays characters which are true to himself, you know, which is really cool. Here's another one, Easter Bunny. You know, he's going to be a terror. You know, you know that, right? <laughs> he's got an edge, hasn't he? Yeah, yeah. It's going to be really cool, you know. Um, and the supporting cast is really cool as well. You know, my little Christian's going to love it. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Is your missus here? Because uh, James Marsden. She, I, I think she's more Ma Matthew McConaughey. So, uh, well, I can't disagree with her either. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. What are yeah, you up so to? Looking it? forward to it. Completely looking forward to it. Um, what am I up to? Yeah. Um, singing, writing. You know, just looking forward to getting everything um, kind of where I want it to be. You know, X Factor's a big show, so you know, guys like myself have got a lot of hard work to do. You know, I didn't win it, so you know. So you've got a good chance of being, you know, huge. <laughs> Don't say it like that, come on. No, I really, I, I love all the guys who are in the show. Actually, this year was a very talented year, and I thought a lot of the guys in the show have a lot of potential to do really well. So, you know, I, I feel like I can do really well, but, you know, a lot of hard work, as I said. So. Oh, yeah, 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 I mean, if you don't put the work in, it doesn't pay off. What you've done is giving yourself the platform and, and the opening there to, yeah. to have, you know, for an audience, yeah, exactly. and it's up to you now to, to make it happen. Yeah. Like the people always say, what's the best advice you can give somebody? And I'd like, if, as a musician, I'd just say, just sing the song, man. Just, you know, if you love it, do it. All great artists suffer before they become famous. That lady wrote Harry Potter in a ditch. I have the talent, I have the drive, I have to avoid whatever that was. You know what? We can leave the insurance companies out of this. Ah! I'd just like to ask, because you're used to working with children, is an animation a, a great way for kids to become kind of immersed into the arts and crafts and be inspired to come on to be actors themselves? I think it's really encouraging because there's a, a, a character there, you can, they can hear the voice and they know they recognise the voice, so it gives them, if, if, they're, if they're nervous about performing themselves, it gives them a chance to put on a character, maybe behind a puppet and stuff, it gives them creative ideas and, and it's full of creativity, so yes, I think it's great for the arts. And, and, and what advice really have you got for children that do want to come into the arts? 
I run my own performing arts school and it, it starts off with building confidence and after the confidence is built then, then they realise that this could be a job for them, it could be something they can do. And it's just going in for an interview and be able to shake someone's hand and engage them eye to eye that that, that instills you. Every, every child that comes to the academy I'm like, good morning, I'm Kevin Adams, they say good morning and they say their name and they've learned to do that and I, the reward that I get from the parents saying okay oh, I'm so glad Sam's so much better and he's engaging more with people and he was shy and he's not so shy anymore so it's, it's a rewarding job I didn't think it was going to be rewarding no I've got two girls of my own but then when, when people told me I was going to look after other people's children I was like uh -uh. I can deal with my own, not other people's children, but I absolutely love it. It's a cliche, I don't care, I love it, and it is so 100% rewarding. Can you tell us the name of your, your academy, give it a good plug. Um, my academy is called the Kevin Adams Academy. You can find it at www.thekevinadamsacademy.com. Brilliant, thank you very much, yes! <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. I'm fine, thank you, are you good? Very well, thank you for an early Sunday morning start. Yeah. <laughs> what are you expecting from today? Well, the boys are looking forward to it, aren't you boys? What are you looking forward to? They're getting shy, bless them. Yeah, I love Russell Brand, so it's cool. And the boys are at the age where they kind of like these kiddies' movies, but with the adults in, do you know what I mean? So, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. There's a bit of something for you and a bit of something for the children yeah, as well. Yeah, definitely. The bunny and then we've got Russell Brand, the voice for me. Don't let the dad hear that. <laughs> what about um, James Marsden? Yeah, brilliant actor, funny guy, yeah. I'm looking forward to it. We need to find EB. Assemble the pink berets at once. Oh, I could bunk down anywhere. West Wing, Master Suite, I'm not picky. All right, how are you doing? I dragged you out again. Yeah, drag no, it's easy. It's brilliant, isn't it? Sunday morning with the kids, go and see a movie. I love it. You'd be, you'd be up anyway, wouldn't you? Yeah, I would. I mean, uh, we're, the second you have children, you never have a lie-in again in your life, I don't think. So what is it that we like about the, the Easter Bunny now and Bugs Bunny and Roger Rabbit? Well, we immediately think chocolate, don't we, if we're about this high? Easter, chocolate, OK, I'm up for it. They've been begging to come and see this film, though. They're completely aware of it. Uh, and I said, yeah, I didn't have a clue what it was about. But looking forward to it. I'm just slightly concerned I might have to wear the Easter Bunny ears all the way through the film, but I think I'm going to get away with it. <laughs> They've been handing them out. They can't, well, they literally are. They can't give them away. They're quite cute, though, aren't they, actually? They're not bad, yeah. So, uh, what, James Marsden, are you looking forward to seeing him a bit of eye candy of a Sunday morning? Yeah, and um, Russell Brand. There's a good choice. I know, you wouldn't put them together, would you? <laughs> no, quite bizarre. But Russell Brand's a crazy guy, you know, it's, and the films that he's done, I've really enjoyed, so I think it'd be quite funny. He's really sort of got integrity with whatever he does, hasn't he? I think so. You kind of think, is this is somewhere in there, is he just taking the mic? Probably, I don't know, but I, I like what he does. He makes me laugh. Hello, Charlie, how, how are you doing? doing? Very well, thanks, very well. <laughs> you looking forward to uh, today's film? I am, yeah, my, I brought my son with me, Stanley, who loves anything cinematic. Although we have had to bring ear defenders, because uh, he sometimes finds the adverts too uh, loud. So, uh, But uh, yeah, no, he's, he's um, no, it's good fun. And uh, yeah, I, I, I love um, Alvin and the Chipmunks, so... Uh, we're looking forward to this one as well. So, so one for, an ad for adults, just well, as it's much one as of the uh, bearable ones when you're a, when you're a parent uh, and you stick it on in the DVD and you think, oh, I'll leave that on for a bit, leave them with that for a bit. And now, in the Chipmunks is one of the bearable ones. So, especially the squeak wall, that's particularly good. So, I've got high hopes, high hops, <laughs> got high hops. Well, what are the newspapers for? Yeah, you know, you're an animal, so. Oh, I understand. I'll just sleep down here among my poo and pee like a pig. Now he's chasing his dream. Never had one formal lesson. And letting nothing. Fred, why am I in a box? Stand in his way. I'll behave. I'll clean up my mess. I'm special. <laughs> I'm really special. What are you doing? Jelly beans? So you talk and you poop candy. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. So what are you hoping from today's film? Well, I've seen the trailer. It looks quite fun. It's um, going to get us in the mood for Easter, isn't it? I'm a fan of Russell Brand as well. I've seen most of his films. So, yeah, it'll be nice to see a film with him doing the voiceover. And there's, uh, the, he's obviously the Easter Bunny. and We've got Roger Rabbit and Bugs Bunny. What is it that we love about rabbits? I think they're just fluffy and cute. And I can't wait. They've apparently got eight-week-old bunnies upstairs. So, really looking forward to seeing them. I might try and steal one Put it in my coat <laughs> and it'll keep you warm yeah back to this perspective what's it like to do animation and what's the process of of preparing for you um 
to be honest, because I'm maybe the vet <laughs> in Postman Pat, so I know all about the animation thing. Um, it's quite hard actually, it's quite a hard thing to do because a lot of times you don't even get to do it to the picture. You just have to make it up and it all has to be 10 times bigger and louder than what you would do it in real life. And then you just have to cross your fingers and hope that it looks all right when it, when it, when it comes out. You have to be careful like, like of your voice perhaps, you know, that you don't strain it and, and maybe use different techniques. Oh, absolutely, that's exactly what you should do. You know, you shouldn't drink or, or uh, be in smoky environments, but unfortunately they, they get actors to do this and, and actors don't really stick by the rules. And actually we feel that we can stay out till five o'clock in the morning, drink, smoke and then go in and do such sessions. And what, do you, what are you expecting from Russell Brand today in his performance as the Easter Bunny? I cannot, Russell Brand being the Easter Bunny, uh, it's all kinds of wrong in my life, <laughs> in my opinion, sorry. And, uh, and so, yeah, I'm intrigued. I cannot wait to see or hear. This spring, you're not getting it. I have a date with destiny. It's all about candy. Don't eat that. You might not like the flavor. Fred, relax. Watermelon. What are you expecting from today's film? Uh, fan and enjoyment. It's a kids' film. We can't wait. <laughs> yeah, just looking forward to it. Really. I love cinema and come cinema. So, last one we see was Justin Bieber. And that was really good. So this is our yeah. second one, isn't it? In the, in the month. <laughs> that was that was fantastic film, wasn't it? Yeah, it was amazing. It was so good. I I've never been a huge fan. Now after that, now I'm a big fan. I, and I'm with you all the way yeah. there. <laughs> it's good. We've got James Marsden in the film as well. Very handsome. Are you looking forward to seeing him? Yeah, I can't wait. <laughs> I've never heard the name, but he sounds nice. <laughs> He's in the X Men. Never watched that either. <laughs> oh, no, well, you won't, you won't be disappointed. <laughs> Jigs. Can I at least touch it? Ow! There, we touched it. Thank you. That's it for the gala screening of Hop. I'm Claire Bueno. You're watching Premier Scene, and we are hopping off. And rock and roll. Stop! Stop! I didn't like it. I loved it. Ah. Look at this. <laughs> Look how cute this stuff bunny is. Oh, oh he's so sweet. And cute and cuddly and 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 warm. She's seeing anyone? No, she's single and she's looking for a rabbit.